Good morning, guys. Happy Thursday. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome back. I've been to a few stores. I went to Victoria's Secret, which I'm going to show you. Uh, Bath and Body, right, right over here. Walgreens, and all of that over there is Target. Let's start with Target so we can knock that out. The first thing I picked up was the Downy Wrinkle Release right here. It's priced at $7.19. And if you go to Lozo.com, you can pick, pick up this $2 coupon, which I have not used yet, but that will bring the total down to $5.19. And then once you pay that, submit your receipt to Ibotta and get $2 back. And since I cashed out on Ibotta, I can actually say I paid $4.19 for this huge bottle of Wrinkle Release Plus. And here is my little receipt where you can see that. But you can't see the rebate. I showed you the rebate on um, to the right of the screen. You can see the rebate. But with this right here, I just got to take my receipt back with the coupon and get my $2 back. And my I've already cashed out on my Ibotta. So I got my money back. And you can see right there, after I take the coupon, it'll be $5.19. And basically, it's already $5.19 since I cashed out on Ibotta. And with the... Coupon, it'll be $4.19 for this. Oh, so much for those. Then for the Dove hand wash, if you buy four participating products, you get a $5 gift card. Well, I picked those up. And they were priced at $2.99 each. I could have bought those at Walgreens. Walgreens is priced a little higher. And it came out cheaper for me to do it here at, I was already at Target. And it was cheaper out of pocket. I didn't want to use up all my points at Walgreens, basically. And I don't have that many left. And I didn't want to use them up on the Dove hand wash. But they were $2.99. And then when you buy four, you get a $5 gift card. My total after, before the $5 gift card was $11.96. There is no cartwheel or anything for that. And yes, I could have mixed and matched with something else. So I could have, could have gotten a, um, another rebate for my bada. But I don't like Suave. And that would, I just don't like it. But I do love this hand wash. I don't think I use any other hand wash but that, to be honest, right now. And here is my receipt. As you can see right there, 12 12 was my total. I used a $5 gift card that I already had. I paid $7.12. I got back a $5 gift card, and I, got, I redeemed for three of the Dove bottles, and I got back $4.50 on Ibotta. Woohoo! And then for the razors, let me move this out the way. My third transaction at Target was the Bounce 250 count. It was $9.99. And the Pure Clean is $11.99. And the Big Razor was $5.99. I priced to match that. We can do it at the register now, guys. Woohoo! But I price matched that for $3.99. As you can see right there on my receipt, I think it's the last item, $3.99. The four, there's a $4 coupon on Cartwheel, which makes that free. You know, that's the only way I'm buying razors now. So, And it seems like I'm getting so many of them, so you might as well get them there free. But that was free after the coupon, so make sure you go do that. Make sure you price match, and it's free after the coupon. And then for the bounce, there's a 10 percent off cartwheel for the dryer sheets and a 10 percent cartwheel for the pure clean plus there's a five dollar coupon off of the pure clean and use the one dollar off on the png or off of the pgeveryday.com website and after all of the coupons my total was 14.27 
1519 after tax and I did use the red card guys so my total was a little bit lower even though it doesn't seem like they took off the 10 percent it just didn't add up for me not at all but um I don't know then I wrote a five dollar gift card I paid 1019 for both bottles of well for this bottle of pure clean and the bounce sheets plus guys this pure clean is so good omg that's the that's what's on top of my um washer right now i'm absolutely loving it i've put the per seal down i'm absolutely loving the pure clean but after you purchase these two i'm sorry you get a five dollar gift card so i paid 1019 and i got back a five dollar gift card now for um they also have towels at my store they were 50 percent off and if you've seen the my instagram you would have seen that the set of hand towels right here were three dollars plus there's a 15 percent off on bedding and bath if your store will take the car wheel because at target the clearance items you're not supposed to use the car wheel some people take them some people don't it's at the cashier's discretion buyer beware that just lets you know. So I bought three sets of hand towels. This is blue. This one is gray. And then this is a different style altogether right here. But those were $3. And then they had a set of towels. And I'll throw up the picture right here. Where they're $7.50. I didn't get those. Because I didn't like those. I'm a threshold girl. I only buy threshold towels. That is the power of couponing you can choose to be choosy about which towels you're going to use in your household and i get the expensive one the threshold towel was on clearance for this was also 50 percent off it was 9.99 it was 4.99 and um i took the last two they had i picked up two of them so and that is it for tarjay guys tarjay so let's move over I did end up going back to Walgreens and doing my trash bag deal. They did end up taking them that the dollar off of the trash bags again for me. You can ask since it's an advertised deal and it's advertised in a weekly ad. Don't just say that there's only a 50 cents coupon. Tell them you want the dollar off. It's an advertised deal on the weekly ad. That they made these four dollars each, and I used points to pay. I paid $2.96 out of pocket for the three boxes of 50 each in each box trash bags. That is a good deal for me. Plus, I did the Oral-B deal. And I chose the toothbrushes because there was an Ibotta rebate. And I ended up getting $3 back on Ibotta and $2.50 back on Saving Star. I couldn't do the Checkout 51 because it's tied. And what I usually do, I would have done the checkout 51 first and then scanned for Saving Star. But you have to clip the Saving Star in order to redeem the rebate before you purchase. So half of most of the time, I don't do checkout 51. I just do Saving Star. I know it sucks and I, I need to open a new check, uh, checkout 51 account. But I'm close to cashing out. Once I cash out, I'm going to open a new checkout 51. But um, here is the Oral B. You pick up three for eleven ninety seven. I did have a coupon. It did not come off. I called um, Walgreens, the eight hundred number, and they did issue me my one thousand points, twelve ninety six out of pocket. I used ten thousand points, and I so I paid two dollars and ninety six cents out of pocket, and I got back the six dollar registry reward, which I'm going to use today. Along with the $3 registry award from the toilet paper deal I did earlier Sunday. And uh, um, I'm going to do the spin 25 to get 7,000 points. Plus, guys, I was walking into the store to do a purchase so I can get the bonus. And look at all of the great receipts that were laying right at the top of the garbage. I, got, I found two of the beauty perks right here and then several spin fives i got several of them they were just all laying on top of the garbage and a 20 percent off that i don't usually use 
but they were just laying all like this, just all, just all in the garbage. And I gladly took them off of their hands. So I was too happy for about that. And I am definitely ready to do Walgreens today. But I stopped at Bath and Body and this is my $40 purchase. This is the only candle that I usually buy now, only candle. And since I have burned my last candle, I picked up two French baguettes, baguettes and then the lavender vanilla. I should have just got three of the candles that I liked, but I was trying to do something new, um, just something different. And I really felt like I should have just stuck with what I really, really wanted. But anyway, I got three of those candles, a hand wash for $3, and this for $1.75 to push me over the $40 mark. And I used my tin off for $30 at, at um, Bath & Body. Now, yes, I could have gotten like a bunch of hand soaps and stuff like that, but I stocked my mom up on the hand soaps for Christmas. And I don't usually use the hand soaps because I don't like them. But, um, so I just picked this one up. I'm going to use it. I'm going to stick it in my son's bathroom. And then, uh, so this is it for my bath and body purchase. And then for my Victoria's Secret, because I'm always buying my granddaughter stuff, I bought her mom some stuff from Victoria's Secret because, so she wouldn't feel left out. We must treat the mom sometimes. That's my hubby's daughter. And I picked her up two brassieres right here i wonder no one has ever showed that victoria's secret haul i wonder but i thought those were cute and i picked those up i hope she likes them i left the receipt in the bag so that if she wanted to return them and get something different she could i didn't care but this is their 75 annual sale i guess just like bath and body and they take 75 percent off they needed to take 75 percent off those prices are so freaking high but i also picked her up a some leggings right here that you can see just some little cute leggings and I had no coupons for this guys this was just a gift and then I picked up a little t-shirt to go with the leggings and it had pink on the sides hopefully she'll like that but guys that kind of concludes my haul and this is my haul for Thursday a fantastic Thursday guys now I am off to Walgreens to do suspend 25 and get my 14,000 points using my paper and my digital hopefully they will work together until next time next video which will be in a couple of hours I'll see you later peace out